This time last year, I had zero clients and zero revenue. Today, I run a $10,000 a month AI automation agency, and I did it using tools like NA to N and using one simple strategy on Upwork. And I did all of this without writing a single line of code. So in this video today, I'm gonna show you exactly how I did it, step by step, and if you stick around until the end of the video, I'll show you how you can download the entire blueprint for this automation. Let me show you how the automation works. So for the first step, you wanna head over to Upwork and do a search for any type of job. I'm in the automation space, so I've done a search for automation, and you can see that it's returned a bunch of jobs. Now, the one that's piqued my interest is this one here, because I do a lot of work with NA10 and also Make. So this is an NA10 Make expert to build simple automations for an agency. The payment is verified, the reviews are five star, or 4.9 out of five. The client has spent some money and then the United States. So they kind of tick all my boxes, right? So I'm gonna click inside of here and just bring up the job post. Now in the old days, I would actually have to read all of this, right? I'd have to make sure that it makes sense. I understand what the requirements are, everything that I need. But now what I need to do is just, I copy all of this and then head over to N8N, bring up this agent. I'm just gonna bring up the chat and then I'm just gonna paste this inside of here. So what this is gonna do is this automation agent is actually gonna plug it into a language model. It's gonna create a mermaid chart and I'll show you what that is in a sec once it's complete. It'll create the proposal document, which helps me stand out from the crowd and it'll actually help me create the cover letter, which I send back to the client on Upwork. The automation is complete. So you can see here that it's created the mermaid diagram. It's created the Google proposal inside of Google Docs and it's created the upper application. So let me show you what the mermaid chart is. So I'm gonna copy all of this and then I'm gonna head over to Whimsical and then you just paste it here. So I'm just gonna paste this and you can see that it's actually created a mermaid chart, which is like a process flow diagram. And this is great because it just helps you stand out from the crowd. So what I'll do is I'll just cop take a screenshot of this, copy it and then head over to the Google Docs proposal. So this is automatically generated by the AI agent as well. And then I'll just paste this mermaid chart inside of here. Now what's interesting about this approach is that I haven't actually read any of this job brief, right? It's completely automated and personalized for both my skill sets and how they are applicable to this job post, right? And how they are relevant for this client. So you can see here that it's actually done a bit about me based on how I've trained the AI agent. And it's given the client a very personalized approach, right? Because it's it's gonna output the the file in JSON or Make Blueprint. It's gonna use NA to N or Make because that's based on what they've asked in their job brief. And there's bits about webhooks and all that, but I actually haven't read any of this. And then the last part of the automation is this here. So all I have to do is just copy this and then head back over to the job. So where I would go here, which is apply now. And this is how I would normally apply. So I'll just collect, just set it up as I normally would. I'd use the marketing automation profile. Everything else stays the same. All of this is just gonna be defaulted what I normally set it up to. And I'm just gonna paste this here and that's it. And there's literally nothing more to it. All I need to do is just send this off and I can do this very, very quickly. If I wasn't recording a video, it takes about 30 seconds to a minute for the AI agent to produce all this content for each job, which means that I can knock out 20 to 30 automation sponsors or job proposals in you know, like an hour. Now, you might be wondering, is using AI a violation of Upwork's terms of service? And I know what you're thinking, you know, it does sound like a massive advantage over all your competitors, and it is. The one thing I will say is that Upwork actually encourages the use of AI and they've actually got a built-in AI tool called Uma. It's called Uma AI and they actively recommend us to use it. Now, this is automated, this is AI, but we're not automating it all inside of Upwork, which means that it's not a violation of their terms of service. I still have to you know, create the content outside of Upwork and I'm still doing it inside of NA10 and the Upwork response has been copied and pasted. So that whole part of it is very manual and it's not a violation of their terms. And if you wanna save time and download this automation directly into your NHN account, click on the link in the description and sign up for the Automation Kings private AI community. Inside of here, I've got a bunch of classrooms. I've got all the automations that I talk about on the YouTube channel. I've also got automations that are exclusive to this private community. We've also got a you know, bunch of people in here that run agencies, that work for startups, or they just you know, wanna create a side hustle using AI and it's a really friendly bunch. So click in the link in the description below, sign up and I'll see you on the inside. But before you go, do me a solid, smash the like button if you love this video, sign up to the channel and become a subscriber if you haven't done so already, turn your notifications on so you know when the next video drops and I'll see you next time. Take care.